Okay. Ada kak Ricci. Kita masuk di yang itu video. Masuk di slide. Oke. Okay. Oke, okay, Wan. Oke, okay, if you are okay, uh, we can start. <clears throat> Hello everyone. Firstly, I would like to say thank you for having us as presenter. My name is Richie Rich Ringo. And with me are my teammate Delon Dio and Kairul Ikwan. We are from Keninga Vocational College, Sabah, Malaysia. Today, my team and I will present our final year project, which is multi-purpose box. Vechi, uh, can you turn on your camera? Is that possible? Uh, okay, uh, that's better. Continue. Electricity is one of the most important thing that we need in our daily life. Unfortunately, there are places where disruption in power supply are common and worse. Some places do not have power supply at all. In order to solve this issue, my team and I plan to create this toolkit known as multi-purpose box. As you can see in the slide, multi-purpose box can be used in a place that has no constant and stable supply of electricity and it also can be used during emergency like when our phones or torchlight run out of battery. Uh, I'm can sorry Ricky, can you hear me? Could you, could you turn on your camera? Camera? Yes, because uh, the your camera should be turned on at least seventy percent of the season period, session period. Thank you, Rick. You can go. Uh, we, we cannot hear you, Ricky. Your microphone is off now. Okay. Are you ready? Okay, yes, you can go. As you can see in the slide, Multi-purpose box can be used in a place that has no constant and stable supply of electricity, and it also can be used during emergency like when our phone or torchlight run out of battery. We can always use multi-purpose box that can provide power supply and it is equipped with some features like light and compass. The main component for our project, the main component of for our project are USB port, socket, battery, torchlight, and compass. In some place like forest or rural village, there is no power supply at all, or if there is any power source, it is either inconsistent, unstable, and limited. Thus, we need a tool that can help people charge their device like phones, as well as power some electrical appliance and equipment, including lights, which are important when it gets dark. There are several objectives of this project. The first one is to provide source of electricity in place where there is no stable power source. To create a toolkit that is eco-friendly and equipped 
with additional features like compass, which can come in handy in certain situations. We also designed this toolkit for emergency purpose. We will never know when we might run out of power that we need a backup power source. We plan to first create a prototype and test it ourselves. We then will get a panel of experts to examine and evaluate the functionality and practically practicality of our project. And finally, we will distributing questionnaire to our potential user to get their feedback on it. This is the cost of our project. We have totaled up the cost of each item that we need to create our first prototype. We need RM209 to make it happen. Thank you, everyone. Okay, you finished.